we are going to discuss this one so this function here the function is given right so we have to check whether there exists a power series around zero around zero with radius of conversion r such that f of x that power series converges to this function f of x for each x in between negative r positive r right so we have to check check there exists a power series like this right suppose f has a power series about zero right something like this uh, for each also for each for each x in between negative r positive r right mm -hmm. let's look at our theorems here look at this one suppose that the power series this one, this power series around zero is this power series converges to F in this interval, right? Has radius of R, radius of R, convergence R. Then F is differentiable. So when you differentiate this power series term by term, then you get a power series like this. That this power series converges to f prime in, in the same radius r that's very important right right so if you apply this theorem again so right so when you when you differentiate this one so here you have this one here. so this thing right converges to this f prime Right now you have a power series for f f prime. So from this theorem, this this theorem, f prime is differentiable in this interval, right? Then the so when you differentiate this power series again, so then you get another power series. Then you get another power series. That power series converges to f double prime in the same interval with the same radius but it doesn't true in this case because so look at the function look at this function here so this is not differentiable at uh, so this one is differentiable at zero so when you differentiate this function again you get something like this f prime of x is 2x for x greater than or equal to 0 other one is 0 x less than 0 uh -huh. So look at this. Uh -huh, this one is differentiable at zero. But in this theorem, this theorem, if you apply this theorem for this this power series, this power series converges to uh, f prime. Uh -huh. f prime has a power series, which is this. If you apply this one again, this theorem says f prime is differentiable in this interval right uh huh all right f prime is differentiable f prime is differentiable at zero right so if you draw f prime something like this if x is less than zero you will get function zero other one is a straight line uh huh this is your function but f prime is 
this one. So we know that f prime has a power series, then you can see it in this interval, right? So from this in from this theorem says this theorem says f prime is differentiable in the same interval, but but when you look at the function f prime is not differentiable at zero, right? That means that means there does not exist a power series uh, with radius r such that that power series converges to this function f for each x. The reason is f prime is not differentiable at zero. f prime is not differentiable at zero. That's why uh, you, you cannot generate a tail expansion of, of f around zero. So if, if there exists a power series like this, that power series converges to f, that means you can generate a tail expansion uh, like this here. Look at, look, at, look at this theorem. If a power series exists, around C or whatever around C which converges to F with radius R then you can generate a tail expansion around that point around C in our case around zero around zero right so therefore there does not exist a power C hope you understood this bit here then you can do uh, practice class 12 uh, this one this problem very easily practice class 12 a uh, yeah. good luck guys